Hey, this is Bentley Brandon again. Thank you for your time. <laughs> I'm always saying thank you for your time because you're giving me time on your timeline of life. You're giving me your energy. And I really appreciate it. The name of this video is called A Dream Never Dies. Woo! Look who checked in, baby. Shakisha. My love over there, okay? A dream never dies. Right on time. We all have been planted a vision. Let that soak in. <laughs> I wouldn't, you know, I wasn't created just to go to work. You know, I work for myself, which is a good thing. But I wasn't created to go to work for anybody. I wasn't created, you wasn't created to go to work for anybody as well. You have a vision inside of you that want to live more than you want to live. I tell Tay, mild and off, share my video, my sweetheart, Tay, baby. <laughs> I always tell her this, and it's a real conversation. And I tell myself this, and I'm telling you this. Between the dreams of what we have, in between that vision inside of us and actually accomplishing it, is fear. In a lot of ways, it's fear. In a lot of ways, we are stuck in a box of fear of what ifs, it can't, I don't know how, but it's already mechanically designed in life to form. Man, I talked to this guy. His name is uh, Miller, um, Jim Miller. He create apps. I told him maybe three, four years ago I wanted to do this app. I had the vision. I'm just giving you my story. I had the vision for this car wash app. I wanted to start with my car wash app, and then I wanted to, to make it a car wash app for the actual public. <laughs> so many years ago, it came alive. It's alive now. You can download it on Apple or Google Play. The thing about it is, listen, and I told somebody, I don't know who I, I tell people the same thing all the time. God created the world in six days. Six days. Okay? Every day is a thousand days. To us, to God. It's a thousand days. So with that being said, your vision is going to take a little time it's going to take a lot of money. It's going to take a lot of faith. A dream never dies. I'm still hoping on my wife, okay? I'm still hoping on all my beautiful things. I'm in a place where I'm not going to let my dreams die because I'm in a new place of discomfort. As a man, you're in a place of discomfort, woman or man. Hey, we still in it. Don't let your dreams die. Because God got it already designed to manifest in your life. And if he gave you the vision, no thought, and I said this, every thought is an idea from the source or the other source. It's two sources. You have your own thoughts. But thoughts are just floating in the air, just passing by. Who can they land on? <laughs> Don't let your dreams die, because if they die, you die. No, A man without a vision shall perish. Look it up. It's biblical. Thank you for your time.